Today at Deutsche Auto Parts, we're going to be going over installation of a camshaft position sensor on a 2.5 five-cylinder engine. We can start by removing the engine cover. Now this particular vehicle we're working on has an aftermarket intake, so normally what you would have would be a duct that would run here uh, to the front radiator support of the vehicle for, for directing airflow into the engine cover, which is also uh, the air box, the air filter is housed inside here, and then a pipe that would run from here to the throttle body. So once you would remove those pipes, the, the duct, and then that pipe that attaches, all you do is pull up and there are grommets that hold the engine cover on. And once you get it off the four grommets, you can, can kind of rotate it around. And as you can see here, this is the grommet that mounts the engine cover on. After we've removed the engine cover of the vehicle, here we can find our cam position sensor. And it's very simple to, uh, to remove. All you do is unclip it, pull the connector out of the way, and we have a T30 Torx here that holds it on. Be careful you don't strip it. And we are going to use our VW magnetic bolt tray just to make sure we don't lose that screw. And then usually these are real simple. They only have the seal holding it in and we can take it out and just reinstall the new one. So before we reinstall our new sensor, we will just wanna just real quick, go ahead and clean out this hole where the sensor mounts into inside the cylinder head, this is going to have some oil in there and we want to make sure it seals properly so you don't have any leaks. So once we've done that, we can fit our sensor in. It's good to kind of twist it to push it in place. And then you take your screw and reinstall it. And then we plug it back in. Now we're ready to, re ready to reinstall our engine cover. And our final step is to install the engine cover. And we can do so, we want to put the back portion, kind of angle it down, and then get it done on the mounts. And you can kind of feel it sit in the right place, and then you can just pop them down. And then you're all set. Now, normally, if you had a vehicle with a factory intake, you would have a duct here that you would attach to the front of the radius port. And then this hose you would reattach, which would attach to the throttle body. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe and leave any questions, ideas, or feedback in the comments below.